What is up you guys? So I promise today is a day that we're getting the lift fully functional. We went and bought some ATF, we got some cords so we can run some power from our brains to the generator. So fingers crossed, I'm almost promising you it's gonna happen today. And then also if we do get it up, we're gonna be changing oil in Emma's car. So we'll actually get first actions of this being used. So let's get to it. is very quickly how we're gonna wire the lift and hope that it works. So we're gonna top off the reservoir with eight quarts. Um, we're going to fire up the generator, plug it in, try and raise the lift a little bit to prime it, and then we're going to bleed the cylinders and then fill the reservoir back up after we bleed it and hope it all works. <music> And now those are really high. All right, so it worked. We're good. Now we just gotta climb up and uh, crack it loose and let it bleed. Time to let it go. Yep. All right, so these tubes are spinning. I don't know if they're supposed to or not, but the bleeder cap's on top. So I'm gonna get up there with the impact and try and just bump it loose. And then we'll do the rest with the ratchet. Yeah, I bust it right loose. I'm gonna bust the other one loose and then bleed it manually. Cause we're gonna have to, I'll bled it down a little bit so we'll have to raise it back up. Whew. Don't know if you guys could hear that, but I heard it go pshh. I 
right? I'd probably say that one's blood. Yeah. They're spewing out everywhere. Yeah, I can see an ATF. Well, on the bright side, though, it's all lubed inside. Yeah. I'm serious. Like, we need as much lube as we can get right now, so I don't care. To the previous owner of this lift, please don't hate us. <laughs> I know how you are about your stuff. You guys can see that but it's starting to come out now sweet now we top it off with ATF and call it a day Emma's car and my car, you know, or the bug. Like, obviously, we're not throwing a truck on there yet. We're gonna test it with the light cars first. Right. Hopefully tomorrow. I we'll will say it does seem like there's more ATF. Yep. Yeah. Cause I just. Bump it tight with the impact. I just yeah, I was about to say, I just cleaned that up, and it seems like there's more. It could still totally could still be leaking. Um, could I just? Stuck the ratchet on there and tried to tighten it, and the cylinder started twisting. It would probably only do it on the way up, though. Yeah, it's still leaking. It's leaking. Yeah. Okay. Here, I can bump it tight. Like, when did we, when did we start buying this thing? <sighs> uh, well, had the idea of this thing. It's been it's been months, dude. It's been like before Christmas. Oh, oh yeah. Uh, like I, I had this thing like sitting here. Months. Cause we, it, it was like midsummer last year. It's been, it's been a hot minute. Like this thing has been sitting here at the farm since probably like October. Yeah, probably. September, October. Oh yeah. That's not dried up. Yeah. Sweet. Extra lubrication. So we're just gonna leave it. Sweet. So yeah, we got a functioning lift. We're freaking stoked. I am so stinking excited. This has been honestly like a childhood dream. Like cars are my passion and you know, I've got so many dream cars, but like it's funny enough, a lift has been such a dream for me because I have spent countless hours on cardboard or nothing underneath the car, sliding around, covered in dust and dirt. And you can see it in my videos on the bug and everything doing just routine maintenance is like just such a drag because I know I'm going to be in the mud, in the rocks, even on concrete sometimes, but like sliding underneath, I swapped the, the transmission in that truck. I swapped that on jack stands and on a little concrete pad. And it's the second one I've done in a truck like that. So just the, the thought like that I'll be able to raise the bug to where I can crouch underneath it, or we're going to get a wheelie chair out here roll underneath on the chair and be able to sit there comfortably and see everything and look at what the underside of my wife's car looks like because I've seen it laying on my side and kind of seen it lay out on jack stands but it's just a whole nother world and you can't explain how grateful we are for the friend that actually sold it to us he we couldn't have done it without him the way that we bought it he kind of let us carry the he carried the loan a little bit and let us make payments on it and just everything's come together and we're just super grateful for it. So, <laughs> so yeah, uh, the friend that actually sold us this lift, he's like my other dad. So I, 
I'm gonna get a little bit personal. I was adopted and that was a family that just like took me in and like housed me for a few years, you know, during the summer, stuff like that. So like he gave us an awesome deal, carried the loan for us. And so, you know, shout out to him, not gonna say his name cause he probably doesn't wanna be put up on the internet. But yeah, like even for me, like even oil changes, dude. You know, like I've been doing oil changes like in the grass, you know, at my house. So like this is gonna make it 10 times easier, a lot faster. So yeah, I'm, I'm super stoked about it as well. So we've got, <laughs> yeah, we've got some super ugly exhaust tips on the Corvette. I'll be welding the right ones on because we have a lift now. We got exhaust work needing to be done on the truck that I'm way more motivated and excited to do because we got a lift. So basically everything is gonna be a lot more motivating. So much better, dude. So I wasn't gonna show you guys, but uh, I'll show you guys. All right, so I've been keeping this kind of a secret and we were trying to get the bug over here today. Doesn't look like that's gonna happen, but hopefully tomorrow, I don't think we have to do anything more. So hopefully tomorrow we're gonna get the bug over here and that'll be another video. But I've been keeping this a secret and I'm really excited because this could, should, would hopefully be the end of a problem that's been plaguing me. I bought another transmission for the bug. So I bought that power glide built and it was rebuilt incorrectly and there was an o-ring around the plunger that came off on assembly and as you saw it grenaded and tried to go in reverse and first and just smoked everything. So as you saw I rebuilt the trans and then it doesn't have forward gears, it uh, doesn't have reverse either and I might be a torque converter I'm not sure but I'm about 1300 ish dollars, 13 1400 dollars into that power glide now. I could have bought a built one on JEGS or any site online, or I could have bought something like this for way cheaper. I could have had a really nice transmission for 1300 bucks. But, you know, I was a little more nickel and dimed me, whatever. So I didn't want to keep getting nickel and dimed on the Power Glide and have the progress on the car stop because we are so close to driving it. So I went out and bought this TH350. Um, it's obviously been painted. It is a really clean transmission. The guy I bought it from swore up and down, left and right, all around that it is a good transmission. I got it for such a deal that even if it's a bad transmission, the core is worth more than half of what I paid for it. So hopefully <laughs> this is a good transmission. <laughs> so in the next few days, uh, next few videos, as time permits, we're gonna be bringing the bug over here, throwing it on the lift, dropping the power glide out, Throw the Turbo 350 in there, and we're gonna have to build a new trans cross member for it. And I'm also gonna have to find a shop to get my drive line shortened. So it's not gonna be just a direct swap over, but we're gonna do that. Um, I gotta buy some linkage and a shift cable and stuff, and then we'll be fabricating my shifter setup. I'm really excited about that one. And yeah, so we got a lot coming. Um, I've been keeping this a secret, but yeah. So we're gonna get the wife's car over here. Um, do an oil change on it. We'll probably throw you guys up on time lapse for that. But yeah.